What is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John City 4 here bringing some Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer beta in the background. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you guys do, make sure to leave a like in the video. So, anyways, moving on to the main topic of today, which is about uh, the last gen consoles. And I know I'm kind of late about this news, but I do have some opinions about this. So, the latest news about the Black Ops 3 games on the last gen consoles, which is the PS3 and the Xbox 360, these two consoles, uh, the, the version of Black Ops 3 on these two consoles would not have story mode nor paint shop mode. And the game is going to end up costing $49.99. But at the end, you know, with taxes and everything, the game's going to totally cost like around 51 bucks or 52 bucks. So, um, it's really not that much of a difference, you know, to its original big price, which is like 64 bucks or something like that. And um, I believe they should really lower the cost because, come on, each section of the game is 20 bucks each. Zombies, multiplayer, and story mode, they're all 20 bucks each. 20, 20, and 20 equals 60. That's the full game. If you're going to take away story mode, then that's minus 20 bucks. So, the game should be costing right now... $39.99 and then the game in total after taxes will be 42 bucks or 41 bucks that's how it's supposed to be but 50 I mean like 49.99 that's a fucking rob man you can't rob us like that so my opinion is like they should really lower the cost if you're gonna take away a huge chunk of the game especially the story since it's kind of special this year this year they're allowing you to guys to play with four different players from online Y'all gonna be online, I mean, four players in one story mode, going at it and playing the story. That's super cool, right there. That's kind of similar to um, to Left 4 Dead or like to uh, Destiny or to uh, you know uh, what was the other one, Borderlands. It's gonna have that kind of feeling because you're playing with four players out there. Actually, with three, you know, but four players are gonna be online at the same time, which is something cool. You know, the last time we had a co-op story mode was back in World at War. World at War was like I don't know how many years ago, like five years ago maybe. World at War. I played it along with my brother, and it was a great experience, I'm telling you, it felt like the actual world, world war, like, I'm like, holy shit, you know, and we were, like, reviving each other every time we went down and stuff, and, you know, it was a cool experience. So, um, for this year, you know, Black Ops needs to be doing this co-op thing again, and allow us to play with three other players online, that's gonna be super cool, man, I'm telling you, and I can't wait to do that with my clan, you know, I wanna, I want you guys to play with me and stuff, and, um, I want to record it and everything, and for sure it's going to be a cool experience. We're going to be reviving each other. We're going to be seeing the cutscenes together and everything. Hopefully, it's a super long story. Hopefully, we don't get something short like, for example, uh, Battlefield with a three-hour story. Like, come on, man. I don't want into that. I want at least six hours or eight hours of a story because with a three-hour one, I'm not going to be satisfied. So, hopefully, this year, the story mode is pretty. It's going to be pretty cool. You know, I'm expecting a lot from the story this year i want to know why are these people you know like this you know why are we allowed to actually jump super high and stuff because uh, i saw the trailers i saw the trailers i saw the snapshots and they are really convincing me like i want to play the story now so um like for me to be this hype about the story and then for people that are like right now playing some ps3 and the xbox 360 because they cannot afford a ps4 or maybe they're just trying to save money for something else you know, I feel bad for them because they really want to experience the full Call of Duty experience on, on Black Ops 3. You know, that's kind of sad that we're going to be leaving them out. So, um, this should really change, man. I, I know they can actually move, put the story in the game. They should. <laughs> come on, man. Don't be cutting off your fan base like that. We love you, Call of Duty, but come on. You can't be doing this to us. So, um... So yeah, that's my opinion. Like, they should really lower the price if they're gonna take away the story mode. And plus, I know they can actually add the story mode, like EA, um took that thing uh, online 24-7 st stuff on The Sims. I'm not sure you guys remember this, but um, a long time ago, they uh, EA created a game called um, SimCity. I think it came out like two years ago or three years ago. And um, that game was actually online required 24-7. And then later on, people found out you can actually play on offline because uh, EA was saying that, oh, it's impossible to make this game offline. And then people messed around with the files and they actually found a way to actually make the game play playable offline. And then EA was pretty much caught in their freaking bullshit. And then um, they were like, OK, let me let us make an update so you guys can play offline. I'm like, are you guys not going to apologize to the people, you know, not letting them play offline whenever they want? Like. That's super fucking dicked out. So that's my comparison between this and that. Like, I'm, I know Troy Art can actually make a story for the last gen. Don't be a dick, man. So, so yeah, guys, if you're, you're a subscriber right now, you're currently playing on the PS3 and the Xbox 360. I mean, I'm sorry, man, but 
you only you can only play zombies and multiplayer, which I know some of you guys are mostly on 24/7. I know some of you guys don't play the story mode. So that's it, guys. So my next video, I'll talk about the uh, paint shop. I'll let you guys know how the paint shop is and um, is it good or bad. I'll let you know. So that's it. Subscribe for more, guys. Want to see more Call of Duty content?